Hey everyone, in today's video I'm gonna show you my process in how to upload videos to YouTube. So first of all you have to open Google Chrome or whatever application you use to upload videos, navigate in internet. So this is actually really really easy, you have to go at the top of your screen and you'll see this icon that says create, you have to click on that and then as you see, you can choose where you want to upload a video, go live or create a post. So in this case, you have to select upload video. And now this other screen will pop up on your screen. And as you see, you can drag or drop video files to upload. If you don't know what is drag a file, it means that you have to go manually to find the file you want to upload drag a file it means this you put it from your folder to the YouTube video uploader and the other option is just click on select files and choose the video you want to upload and now your video is being uploaded to YouTube so now you have to select a title for the video I recommend to put the year of the video between parentheses because the people will notice that the video is from this year and it's not old so let's put 2022 in the description as you see you can mention a channel as well but here is where you have to tell your audience about the video you are uploading. So in this case, I remember it was a video of fixing a problem in Microsoft Edge. So let's put something like that. You can also put some hashtags. And below the hashtags, I recommend to have some pre-written speech about your channel. So in my case, I will have to go to my channel content, type in edit the details of a video. And as you see at the bottom, I have this pre-written speech. So I'm just gonna go and copy this and paste it here. And as you see, what I have here is the information about the channel because you want people to subscribe to your channel and also our social pages. Below the description, you can select or upload a picture that shows what's in your video. This is called a thumbnail. So you can choose one of the images that YouTube suggests or you can upload a personalized one that you edited somewhere before. So if you want to choose one of the pictures, you just have to click it and if you want to upload a personalized thumbnail, you have to click on upload thumbnail. So let's click on that. As you see, I have a thumbnail created specially for this. So let's click on that. And as you see now, the thumbnail looks really professional and really cool. Then you can choose if you want to put the video inside a playlist. So as, as it's a how to fix video, I'm gonna choose the playlist of how to fix. You can create your personalized playlist as well. All you have to do is click on new playlist and create a new one if you want. Here you can also unclick this and make your chapters by yourself. How to do that? Well, you just have to go again to the description and just by putting 00, 00, 00 YouTube will understand that this is the beginning of uh, timestamps and the chapters that you will be creating. So all you have to do is watch your video and add the timestamps to the description of the video. And well, keep going like this. When you see something that you want to add to a chapter, all you have to do is put the time of the video in the chapters. So moving on, we have our tags. Tags can be useful if content in your video is commonly misspelled. Otherwise, tags play a minimal role in helping viewers find your video. When you have a tag, press enter and the tag will be ready. Then the language and certification, category, here you want to choose the category of your video. In this case, let's put science and technology. And here if you want to keep your comments and ratings or you want to hide it. Moving on to the next tab, 
we have video elements here you can choose if you want subtitles if you want an end screen and if you want some cards to appear in your video so as before if you want to add an end screen all you have to do is click on add and choose some of the templates that YouTube offer us let's click on that now you can edit from which part of the video the ad will appear you can move this like this here you can choose your most recent upload the best for viewer or a specific video I usually leave the most recent upload option because it will be changing depending of the most recent upload but you can also choose a specific video if you were talking about something specific in your video for example an update in mm, Windows 10 for example so I'm gonna click on that and when you have it ready you have to click on save the same is for cards you have to click on add and choose one of these options for example I don't know a video as well so let's click on this one and click on save when you have this ready now we have to go to the last tab that is visibility this is important as well because you can choose if you want the video to be private so only you and people you choose can watch your video the difference with unlisted is anyone with the video link can watch your video it doesn't matter if it's a contact or not and public so everyone can watch your video you can also set as an instant premiere this means that all of your followers will see that you are premiering a video and you can also schedule the video to a specific date so this is it if you have the video ready you can select one of these options I'm gonna leave it as private because it's just an example video and now you click on save and that's it for today I really hope you enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comments if you want to keep watching and learning from our videos please subscribe to our channel and don't forget to give it a thumbs up thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video